Are you aware that animals coin specific names for their groups? Indeed, they do. To how we christen different teams. Animals too bestow unique titles upon their groups. A handful could sound common, while others may astonish you. Therefore, brace yourselves as we set forth on this exhilarating expedition to discover these intriguing nomenclatures. Firstly, let's fly by eye in the sky with our feathered friends. Now, did you know that when birds of the same species gather, they have a special name for their group? That's right. So let's take a journey together and discover these unique names. When crows come together, <gasps> they form what we call a murder of crows. <laughs> Quite a chilling name, don't you think? Now, let's move on to our wise friends, the owls. When owls gather, they form a parliament. Yes, just like the one where laws are made. Next, we have the elegant flamingos who come together to form a flamboyance, a perfect name for such vibrant and colorful birds. And then there are the starlings, who, when in large numbers, create a murmuration, a sight that is truly breathtaking to behold. Now, we move to the ground where our furry friends reside. A group of lions, with their majestic manes, is known as a pride. Can you imagine a pride of lions strutting their stuff across the savannah? Next, we have wolves, those howling creatures of the night. When they come together, we call them a pack. A pack of wolves sounds rather adventurous, doesn't it? And let's not forget our hopping friends from down under, the kangaroos. When they gather, they form what's known as a mob. Who would have thought a mob of kangaroos? How about a crash of rhinos? Or a parade of elephants? Even a tower of giraffes? Yes, a tower. And lastly, who could resist the charm of a romp of otters? Or a business of ferrets? Oh wow, <laughs> these land animals sure have some cool group names, don't they? Finally, let's dive deep into the waters to explore our aquatic mates. Here in the deep blue. A group of fish gliding by is known as a school. When you see a bunch of playful dolphins swirling around, they're called a pod. And if you ever stumble a pee a a bop a punch upon a group of jellyfish, um, it's known as a smack. Huh, isn't that intriguing? Eh? Uh, look, <laughs> there's a group of whales in the distance, and we call them a pod as well. Huh? And did you know a gathering of sharks is known as a shiver? Gives you a bit of a chill doesn't it? Over there, a group of seals lounging about is affectionately referred to as a harem. And lastly, a bunch of otters floating together is known as a raft. Amazing, isn't it? How these water animals have such unique names for their groups. And we've learned about the unique names for groups of birds, land animals and water animals. Every animal congregation has its distinctive name. Next time you see a group of animals, remember their special name. Thank you for joining us on this wild adventure. <laughs>